They're so cute. Hey everybody, Kelly, Sue, and Hi! John here from Cleopatra Art Studios, and we're here to paint this beautiful like autumn sign. I feel like it's backwards. Should we, should we switch it? Well then I don't know if you can see it. Okay, I'm gonna stretch, poke it. I like this one. We've had some fun ones, some whimsical ones, and this one's a little more elegant. It's, like it's, it. it's really elegant. So we've learned a lot by throwing, not throwing, <laughs> by putting projects up for you guys. Every Monday we're, we're learning a lot. And I think what we're learning is that my people, you people, our people like elegant. You like fun okay, but right now you want something that you're happy getting out of it maybe if it's too cartoony you're not excited about it so let me just log on real quick happy monday do our monday dance ooh, 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 ooh. burning calories moving floor to floor corner to corner um how you doing today babe i feel better oh i left my glasses in the closet or bathroom would you help me out in the closet maybe, maybe the closet <laughs> don't ask questions you don't want the answer to folks you know now that we have readers and he has readers too. Um, we are leaving them in really hot places. I keep buying the multi pack from the Costco overflow place because they're only $9.95 for three pack. But you know, still, it's not help. It's not helping, guys. Oh, well, we got a, we got some love right we out got the some gate. Love. Somebody give us some love right out the gate. Sprinkle, sprinkle. We're gonna sprinkle, sprinkle. Give we're going to give. Um, this one, there's no gift for the scarecrow because step back, we didn't sell a one. Not a single scarecrow Not went a on the show. Scarecrow. I know. Not I feel like the Tin Man and the Lion combined. I mean, I'm looking at the scarecrow going, What are you? I want to put it out there that John picked out the scarecrow. I, did. I and like the, the scarecrow. The other stinker in the group was the, the 4th of scarecrow. July gnome, and Sabrina picked out that one. So I think, um, I think. It's cute, but you guys were like, eh, what am I going to do with it? Because I was kind of the same way. You know, my grandma had a scarecrow on the wall. Just this stupid little paper, you know, she put up for Halloween or whatever. And it looked just like that scarecrow. And that's what reminded me of it. That's why I wanted it. All Never right. Mind. So I'm here's our new barometer. If it's TMI. something John's grandma would put up <laughs> on the wall, we're not offering it on Monday. So the thing with Monday is, I'm going to wait for my glasses is we are, um, remember when you get these, you want to cut this open. You don't want to just rip and tear. Um, here we go, Monday. So we're just, we're painting this together. We did pre-sell some of these. So some of you guys have these already. And Donna, if you're watching, I owe you one. <laughs> um, we got, uh, Lisa let us know today that it's beautiful. Not even painted, it's beautiful. And she's really happy with it. So I was excited about that. There's multi-layers, there's four. It's similar to the, um, what, the 4th of July Freedom. And that one was really popular, you guys. So you got a bare blank bottom. You have one of the overlays. Is, <laughs> is all these. Then you have the word autumn. And I like the font. It doesn't look too delicate, but it is dainty. And then you have the top layer. So it's pretty simple. I'm expecting this to go pretty quick tonight. Okay, got to get the old lady. Oh, there's, did you lick them first? <laughs> Guys, what do I put up with? Anyway, don't it's forget to- It's one of my small thrills in life. Don't forget to sprinkle, give us a little love, thumbs up, ask questions, we want to know. Inquiring minds want to know. Okay, so I have to go in through my personal because something's all jacked up there. Okay. Yeah, I'm screwed up here. You're jacked up, dude. Oh, hold on, we gotta go down. Yeah, he got me some high tech gadgets. There you go. Am I in? Mm. And I did just change I had to change my password. I got hacked. I got hacked, y'all. And I it was a weird password. password. You need a new finger. <laughs> well, no, it's not gonna do that. You need to do passwords on that. Okay, so here we go. I will I do like the scarecrow, but not as much as the sign and the boo sign, so the scarecrow lost. Yes. I get it, Donna. Um, and even if the economy wasn't hitting us all, like right now, it is hitting most of us now. So I know that you guys are only gonna purchase what you love. And I think the scarecrow was cute. 
is going to make some cute giveaways at, at parties and stuff. But I only want you guys to, you know, buy what you want to love to do. Dude, it comes on my phone and you getting it. Mm. Sorry. Mm. Sorry, sorry. Mm, okay. You're gonna have to you're gonna have to figure it out. Okay. If there's enough time, if John's done stinking around, if there's enough time, I'll teach you guys how to do a tassel. Um, the tassel. Gail, I love the autumn too. I saw you pop up. Um, the photo shows some beads, like a lot of beads. I'm not gonna give you a lot of beads. I'll probably give you seven or eight. Um, and a tassel, and I can show you how to make a tassel. They're not hard. And I, I just happen to have. And when I did kids art, we did. Like at the studio, we've got some good stuff here. I'm gonna look at that and see what we can use. So I'm gonna go different than what the photo suggests. Guys, these are kits. Take them apart, paint them, glitter them, glue them together, display, ta-da, you're done. That one to me is a little bit too pedestrian. It's, it's um, done that way for a certain reason so that you guys can use your creativity, yay. So, I'm not gonna go pedestrian on mine. We're gonna, you use, my, it up. I'm gonna use my favorite copper, y'all. Um, I don't have my favorite gold, but I got my next. This one's okay. It'll work, it'll work. And then, did I put the silver away? Or, oh, I'm looking right at it. So this is a silver I like, okay? No, painting's complete without teal. Um, there may not be teal in this. What? One. I know, but I did the kid one today and it has teal. All right, so I am going to go what I think is elegant. I'm gonna channel my inner Courtney Erickson um, and what she did for the um, Thanksgiving hanger last year, because I really loved it. Mm -hmm. Let's get going. So I'm gonna use some brushes. I'm gonna use some sponges. And if there's time, I'll tell you guys how to cut a tassel. All right, the things I'm reduced to. Okay. So I was gonna go, I was, I didn't want white. I was thinking about cream, but now that I'm looking at it, I'm not in love. So what I'm gonna do is decide whether I want brown. And this is more like a burnt sienna than a burnt umber. Burnt sienna? Yep. <laughs> Woo! So what are you guys having for dinner? I had some uh, chicken and a biscuit. Those crackers, well, my trailer trash background is showing through. <laughs> I kind of like chicken in a biscuit. More than I have. Okay, that's a little too pastel-y, so I'm gonna just bring in that coffee. Cop, cop, fur. Just pastel -y. let's bring the coffee. Let's bring the copper. Still a little bit. Too pastel -er. It is, it's still a little bit. I don't love it. I might have to start over. Dark Dorkosaurus Rex. I am a little dark. You know what, let's go dark. Let's go, let's go really deep, but not too black. So I'm thinking my back and my top layer will be um, identical. Mm -hmm. And then if I don't like it, I can change it. It's just paint. And we're really painting here. I didn't pre-do this. Clearly. Clearly I did not pre-do this. <laughs> you guys are along for the ride and bless your hearts. Are you on yet, John? No, I'm still screwing around. Would you like to use my iPad? Nope. That boo sign, the boo sign gale. I'm sure the boo sign will be the um, project of a month of the month oh. in a couple months. What'd you do? I had Sabrina spring looking for your phone. My phone's right there. Babe. Oh my gosh. Yep. Okay. Well, yeah, I kind of like that. So I'm gonna just water it down because I want it a little sheerer than that. I don't want, so it's a lot like canvas painting. If you stop halfway, you're gonna get a brush stroke that is not gonna go away. No, so you can no. feather it in, but then you want to do full brush strokes. Or you can do it with a wet paper towel, which is what I like to do. Wet paper towel. Make sure you're using the good stuff, like that strong bounty man, and not Kmart Blue Light Special. Is there still Kmart? Is there still what? Kmart. No, but these guys understand what a Kmart is. Well, but I'm curious, do it still exist? Because I know like they merge with Sears, and then Sears kind of merge with Lowe's, kind of sort of for some Well, of the what tools. I found was really weird is that Kmart didn't make it, but like Pomida? It was, it was like an off-brand 
um, Walmart made it. So you don't need a lot of paint when you're doing this method. You do need a strong towel or you need a shop towel. Oh, the shop towels work, those blue ones? Yeah, they work They're great. Good. I'm just not allowed to have any because he hogs them all. Mm. Are you still in? Are you in yet? Okay, stop. <laughs> the 12 year old jokes have begun. So sorry. <laughs> all right. You could do this any color. Like a deep green would be really pretty. Oh, why didn't you go deep green? Probably paint it like five times because it's so pretty. These will make great gifts, guys. Oh, that's what? interesting. What? Well, a gift idea. A gift idea. Like when you love yeah. somebody, but you don't want to do the opposite. <laughs> <laughs> that that would do it for me. Well, what I like about it is, it, <laughs> well, Ooh, that's, thanks, all, baby. that's all you're getting. You're getting a fishing lure and an autumn sign. <laughs> um, what I like about it is, you don't see the word autumn that much. But where I grew up in Pennsylvania, you used autumn. In the South, it's fall, y'all. And here, it's just the hell heat before. <laughs> <laughs> the leaves yeah. change colors. There's actually a fire in the, on the blue highway right now. Yeah, it's really warm right now, guys. Okay, so it's kind of a reddish brown. It's really That's rich. Great. If it does not contrast enough with my leaves, I'm gonna add more glitter. <laughs> That's really pretty. Oh, thanks, babe. Do you think it's um well the wood, right? Or, yeah. 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 Yep, yep, yep. Okay, yep. so Ouch. I'm gonna just boom, boom, boom. Okay, I'm gonna let those dry. They're like nearly dry. Um, I want my autumn to pop, so I'm gonna wait. I'm teal. gonna. <laughs> we could do teal, but I'm not gonna. Um, okay, so I'm gonna put my plate away, and I'm gonna get a new plate. Why? Because I learned from those animals down at Spangle. They go through. If I give them 150 plates, they use 149. I love them, and there's 20 girls in the room. <laughs> 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 they crack me up. All right. So, nobody wants to take that last plate. Nobody wants that they last plate. They have no plate. problem getting up to the end. <laughs> it cracks me up. Okay, so I have a nice gold. It's more like 24 karat. Don't bring the cheap gold. Bring the expensive gold. No. Um, ching, ching. Ching, ching. You could use the 24 karat that's in the little the little container, and it costs a lot. Um, but I'm really happy with this. This one is from Anita's, and typically it's pretty thin. This was this one wasn't too bad. Have you been to Hobby Lobby, Hobby Lobby lately? I've been where? Hobby Lobby. Where? <laughs> Hobby Lobby. I'm blaming the coffee. Hobby Lobby. Um, they, from what everyone's telling me, they're giving me like lots of texts. Um, and they're saying, tear trees are in sale. Carol got one for $7.99 last week. It was wow. teal, Carol. It was teal. So, do they know that that's what you're focusing on now? And so they're just putting them on sale to help out your It's just, that's the, that's the buzzword this, this year. Tiered trays is the buzzword. Tiered buzz. trays are the buzzword. Oh, no, I mean, I don't live this world. Um, right. right, yeah. And I was like, oh, I'm not going to, I don't think I'm going to offer them. But then I did. And so I'm glad I did. Yeah. Yeah. I was like, my people, they like hangers. And then after a while. Some of y'all pay with me every month. You're like, okay, I don't have any more room for hangers. So. Out of doors. I get it. <laughs> I don't love that orange. What was I thinking? The orange is kind of cool. Though. Okay, yeah. I like it that it's not bright. So I am not going for any bright, cartoony colors here. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna grab my sponges. I'm going to Rich. cut them down because it's about getting some mileage out of your sponge. Mileage out of your sponge. I got tired of just using, nope, I can't say it. Your colors look <laughs> rich and delicious. Hey, what's up? Yeah. yeah we know. Sabrina just came to tell me my phone's right here. <laughs> it's my fault. I'm a dummy. That is so funny. Okay. <laughs> I know. I'm so thirsty. Okay. So you can go off. You can miss a little bit if you wanted to because the next layer will cover it up. It'll be fine. And so my only concern is... So this is like a John Proof painting. I could... This is paint by numbers. Yeah. Paint by numbers. And hey guys, if you're just joining, we're doing this awesome autumn sign. Mm -hmm. 
Um, if you want to sprinkle the love, and I want to thank you all so much for sharing the love to everyone in the United States, because I've now had to take Facebook classes to figure out how to talk to the new people. Because, <laughs> you know, they don't yeah, understand me you. like y'all old people do. Okay, so... Old people? You mean your my existing fan base, customers. My fan base. Our fan, yeah. yeah, my existing. They know, they know what I mean. Um... Okay, right. So, I don't want to start off to the side because I might not like what's happening, you know, like I might not like the pattern. So, I am going to start middle-ish. There isn't one exactly in the middle. Designers just don't want to do that. It actually throws off the composition. So, this is, okay, what's the tree that the acorn comes on? Is that an acorn tree? No. Oh. An elm? A ma not a maple. No. It's an acorn tree. But it's got a name. Duh. But the leaf isn't called an acorn. acorn. Okay, you're just lying Maybe. to me now. Oh my gosh. I don't know. Okay. That's a good question. I, That's, I need some brown. Brown? I gotta deepen some of the oh, colors. Exactly. So think about putting two layers on. The first layer should be a little deeper. Oak. Gail says oak. Thank you, Gail. Gail's here. Actually, Gail says oak. That's <laughs> <laughs> like a good question. Gail's so here to make us look be. better. Thank you, Gail. <laughs> Here's your sign, John. <laughs> she, she, it wasn't a definitive oak. It was it's oak. oak. It's <laughs> oak. It is, guys. It's hot. Yeah. And I know there's air blowing on me right there, but I'm drinking coffee and these lights are hot and it's hot. It's hot in here. It's okay if you spill over. It really is. Those dogs. I just left them out. Cause it did get a little cooler and the turkeys were out. That big Tom was out there and he's in the tree now. He went flying. Okay, so my sponge is leaving a little debris behind because I'm totally hitting it hard. Oh, that's pretty. So I'm, I'm kind of counting and I'm thinking I'm gonna, this one's gonna be red too. Yours could all be one color, but don't be surprised that mine are not. Remember, it's okay to go outside. We're going to um, cover that up with the next layer. Go ahead and give it a second coat. Is that, is it, is that Tuscan marble? Tuscan red? It's Tuscan red with brown. Tuscan marble. It's Good Tuscan choice. red. Deco art, you need to come up with a red that I love that's called Tuscan mar marble. Is it marble or marble? I think so. Good choice. <laughs> Killing me, man. Tuscan red. Okay. <laughs> you get confused, but it's Tuscan red. I know, I know. All right. So I am going to give the gold a base coat. I'm going to give it a base coat of, of my brand of raw sienna. I make it myself. Um, because gold is the metallic is thin. It's transparent, and so if you don't put a base coat of a similar color in there. Oh. You're going to see all the, uh, what do you call it, the Particular? wood, <laughs> the wood grain. Oh, oh. my gosh. Well, so what You're making me dumber today. <laughs> <laughs> how is that possible? <laughs> I don't know how I feel about that comment. <laughs> what color did you put under there? I'm sorry. Uh, no, I know that. What okay. color did you put under it? You said you mix it with. Oh, how did I make this color? You said you needed under... I put so, yeah, um, kind of a dingy, unmetallic gold. Unmetallic gold. Unmetallic okay. gold. Wouldn't plain old white work? Um, that can make your gold transparent because it's too contrasty. So this is basically gold, but it's not metallic. Now, how did I make it? Um, so you can make it with, I. so I just did yellow with some brown and some white. That's it. Okay, so you can make this color with bright yellow and dioxazine purple. What color? Yep. Bad. So I like to make my own colors. But specifically if we're going to layer. So I feel like this one over here could be that color. I'm, I don't want to get too carried away. Now you don't want every color in the rainbow, folks. I picked the spicy colors. Look, it's autumn skills. I feel like I have a hair gonna end up in my work okay I am I'm gonna go in here this one's gonna happen 
What's happening? So I'm guessing this is a maple leaf. So the copper also should have an undercoat. That brown would make a really good under under layer. What's that? I guess that's what I was getting at. You said you needed an undercoat for that. Yes. Well, but okay, never mind. I'll so watch the why would I do white? <laughs> I'll watch the replay. Okay, We're so all good. the reason why I'm not doing white is it's just it makes it makes the problem worse. Okay, it makes the problem worse, baby. Trust me. Trust in me. I'm going down. Not that one. Yeah, I'm going to do this one. Probably should have mapped it out. That's okay. We're more spontaneous than that. Mm -hmm. All right, guys. So since we're getting started, what are y'all having? Are you drinking something fantastic? Are you drinking something fantastic? No. Just Diet Coke? Yeah. I'm drinking. I made my big old pumpkin spice latte mix. Are you pumpkin spicing it up? And I put it in with my protein shake. And my protein. So I put a lot of sugar with my non sugar stuff. <laughs> pumpkin protein profi. Yeah, that's a profi. Profi? Is it profi or profi? I don't know. <laughs> All right, so we got two, three. We have three shades. Wait, we got my orange. Else? I gotta get my orange. Oh, yeah. So I'm taking my little chunky monkey one here. Boom. Okay, so I know this one's gonna be orange. So if the magic number is three, what are you doing for? What are you talking about? Oh. No, okay, so that doesn't always necessarily translate. Three I like items. You don't like that color? I do like that color. I'm gonna put the Harley Davidson. Well, it's not called that, it's called Amber, but it's no, a I studly like glitter, so I call it Harley Davidson. Studly. It's studly. I like that. That's going on a t shirt. Studly glitter. I'd wear that. <laughs> You heard it here first, folks. He would wear it. The shirt or the glitter? Because I okay. well, don't judge. Studly glitter. Huh. So funny. I saw a hilarious shirt this week, but I'm not allowed to say it because it's somewhat of a family show. Okay. Yeah. Okay. That was funny though. It was funny. Okay, so here is my dilemma. And I, I pretty much knew I was gonna have it. Is that mm -hmm. these ones will be very similar. But what it'll do is it'll move your eye around. I probably should have made that one. It's okay. Mm. It's just paint, folks. If I don't like it, I can paint over it. See how easy it is? <gasps> Sponging it up. You get on your red. Oh, I did? That's okay. I'm going to probably copper. I'll do some. I don't know what I'm going to do with the red. Um, you know, my red um, glitter is kind of a Christmassy red. So. Tuscan Marvel. Good choice. And that's why I married you. You are in that job. Miss Lisa Lane. Lisa, I really loved your comment earlier. She really liked this uh, design. I don't know if I told you, but um, we sent her one this week. She ordered one online. Oh, good. That's great. I miss those guys. I miss them too. Kit, like, um, Keen graduated from high school this year. Keen graduated? Um. How old am I? Oh, you smell old. <laughs> I know, but I felt weird. You can't blame the dogs anymore. Okay. So. so pretty simple. I wanted it just a little bit more. That's coat one. I did give um, the cranberry two coats. Um, what was I going to do with the brown? That's going to be, these are going to be my copper. You these are going to be my gold. Yeah, you said brown was copper, orange was Harley. Okay. I don't know about the red. Just the more. I'm going to put some gold on if I don't love it. I can hit it with some glitter. So I have kind of a rose gold glitter, kind of. It's more of a, what are they calling it? Champagne. I've never drank champagne that color before. Mm -hmm. um, and then more of a gold gold. And I'll show you guys how to make the glitter glue if, if you're new to our channel. Lisa says she misses our back-to-back -back paintings and you making me look like a dummy. Ah. <laughs> I miss those too. I have, we haven't done a lot of canvas paintings. Um, we've had some people ask us to get back into it. And, um, oops, I'm gonna try, am I gonna put the gold? Nope. Oops. No, you said copper was right, yeah. on the I screwed up. Um, 
to reopen our membership where we give you three paintings a month or something like that for 15 bucks. So we're working on it. We're working on it. Just couldn't do all things, so I wanted to wait on that. You need to explain our back to back. So if you're new and you don't know what a back to back is, when I first started teaching online, I gotta tell you, it was probably right after that 7,000 people showed up to paint with us. I went, I need to get better. So we sat up on two counters and he was right behind me and I was in front of him and I walked him through how to draw and paint on a canvas and he couldn't look at my project. He did pretty good. No. <laughs> you did really good. And anyway, that, that helped me teach better, you know, like to communicate better. Um, <laughs> To the viewer because I had to be like draw this line oh wait a little bit more functional there okay so cool so the gold isn't showing up amazingly but I'm okay with that and a thing to keep in mind when you're using metallics is they have to cure and um, so that you can see what they are, like to see their true uh, color boom hey Laura nice to see ya Gail's here, Lisa's here, Donna, Donna. We have a big group. We have a big group tonight. Big group. All right, here we go. So you can continue going on with that if you wanted to. I want to kind of just see what's going on here. It's going to be really nice, you guys. You could even leave this piece El Natural if you wanted to or something similar. I'm going to glitter a few of these while I'm here. Joyce says hi. Joy. Hello, Joy. Joy. Oh, I still gotta find her, that thingy. Okay, so hold on one second. I'm gonna make my glitter blue. Oh, I have some containers right here. I did make a little video of it, and I will pop it on YouTube um, because people just are like, it's her number. It's, it's easy, but it's like, they don't get it. Do a terrible job of explaining it. All right, so you don't want to glitter bowling. You don't want to glitter everything. Why? Because your eye needs a place to land. Yeah. If it's all shimmery, your eye doesn't know what to look at. It's just it's gonna race over the surface, and you're gonna miss the important details, all the good stuff. Okay, I know I'm gonna do the glitter, the gold glitter. I did pull out that yellow because I was thinking I was going to do some dandelion, but then eventually I decided, I uh, yeah, well, I decided I wanted to go with more elegant colors. So I have what I call Harley Davidson just because that's the orange color. It's called Amber. It's Recollections. That's Michael's. Recollections Amber? Recollections. This is Recollections Gold. So you're using amber and gold. Amber and gold. Okay. Oh, boom. Okay, just gonna mix it up. Put it in place. Okay, guys. I don't know. Can you guys see that? Ooh. Yeah. I can see it coming. Gonna just goob it on, babe. Oh. <laughs> just gonna goob it on. So oh, I. Oh, that's beautiful. I do like to match my paint color to my glitter or get close to it. Yep. I don't want my glitter like detached from my paint color. So you wouldn't use paint on your orange? No, I wouldn't. No, that's just would. me. You would? No, not if I gotta wear it. Okay, so beware adding the glue extends drying time, meaning it's going to take longer to dry this puppy. Okay, oh, can you guys see that? Oh yeah. Are you like digging it? Oh, I'm digging it, I'm all in. I'm all into. Okay, but now I'm like, okay, so this one too. That means I have two Harleys on the top. Well, who painted those? Yeah, that was me. Mm -hmm. um, I almost want to do this one and then I can make that one copper. Mm -hmm. But then I have two coppers on the top. Now, okay, I'm doing it. No. No? Okay. No, that one was your. Um, uh, okay. Oh, okay. no, that one wasn't. He doesn't like to change his mind in midstream. No. Okay, that was my copper. All right, here we go. Looking good. You better, you feel a little bit better about this decision, babe? No, no, I'm confused. <laughs> I'm conflicted. 
John conflicted is not a good thing. He cannot yeah. make a decision when he's hungry. No. Ooh, am I hungry? I don't think you ate today. No, I don't think so. No, I made you a meal, but it was really early, actually. No, I got to make you. I, I had the privilege. I'm sure the dogs <laughs> helped me with it. <laughs> well, really? Well, not intentionally. Mm hmm. And that's why I don't make you anything anymore. Lou's got a reach to her. She's, that basset hound has got a reach to her. This I like a, you know, like something that's got quite a bit of bristles on it. Here's my Walmart brush for the win. Okay, so I was gonna put these on all the gold. This got a lot of bristles. So I didn't do anything extra. Extra, a round brush, not a flat brush. Oh. I didn't do anything extra special to my red. I just deepened it up. To stop handing me. Ladies, ladies. Beat your husbands. <laughs> or you end up with this. <laughs> oh my gosh. So the gold, metallic gold didn't show enough for me. Oh, it's, it's showing good. I this can is see glitter, it. that's oh. why. Oh, I, I, I decided to glitter it up. I'm sorry. That's okay. I still love you, honey. So, to me, this here, one piece, has a suspending leaf stem that I would be careful with that. Um, while you're painting, I mean, it's pretty sturdy, but while you're painting, don't be careless. Don't drink a fifth and decide to paint this um, because that could break there. I mean, like, that would be a weak spot. I want to, um, what's the word? Not age, but what do you call it? I want to do the edges, make them a little bit antique. -y. Oh, you're going to antique it up? No, I don't, that's not even the right word, but. Mm. Okay, let's see what we got here. Let me see if I can go towards, go towards the light, lady, go towards the light. Wait, I'm trailing now. Are you trailing? Yeah, I'm a little bit. I'm trying to see if I can see that. Joyce says nice, so, oh yeah. It's noise. Okay, it's noise. Yes. Okay. I feel like my red is a little too see through -y, so I'm gonna go right back in with some more. Just a moment. Good choice. <laughs> oh my gosh. He is cranked up, ladies. Pray for me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay. Oh, that hurt. Really? It hurt your throat? <laughs> Are you sick? Oh, I'm not. He showed up for us, ladies, and he's not even feeling well. So I didn't put glitter all the way around. I got glitter, 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 and then I skip a few. What do the kids say? One, two, skip a few, 99, 100. Okay. I got to go over the copper one more time. Because there's a little glitter on that. Mm -hmm. I'm going to shade the edges. That's what I was looking for. Shade. shade. Uh, oh, I was thinking gosh. accent. I'm gonna let that dry. And then we're gonna shade the edges. Accent. Accent. So I think I wanna kinda look and see what's happening here. Let's see what it looks like on the background because I may want to deepen it. Got, got some stuff. Got lots of stuff sticking. So that would be the background. Right, the cover, the cover. Well. Because right you don't really need I can't put the the letters on because it's still yeah, like that. So this is what I'm working on. That's beautiful. If any of you guys are really good at acrylic, not acrylic pores, but the epoxy, you could fill this in. That'd be oh. really pretty. Oh yeah. Like a tray or something. I don't know, you don't want to get Maybe to next pretty. week. <laughs> you want to tell who? Oh, yeah. She'd be all over that. So not a pour, but the epoxy. Oh. You know, like I did the Bigfoot table. I know that was a fail. All right, so that's going to dry. I don't know what I would want to do with that yet. Um, but I have to decide. I guess I'm there. Would you do, okay, guys, would you do black? No. For the lettering? It would deepen it up. Um, yeah. Cream? No. Cream? How about a really deep green? Oh, yeah. Yep. Yep, yep. yep. Really yeah. deep green. It's really Not pretty green. just the way it is, and I can see where some of you guys would be like, no. Leave it, leave it. But I'm gonna go intensely dark green. Not, no. 
<laughs> if it didn't have the back, you could do well, I'm trying plain, to get, I'm trying, like you just had it. Right, but I'm trying to get over it away from pastel. Right. No, no, no. I, know, I, I was teasing about that green. Oh, okay. I was teasing about the green. Oh, I was saying that if you didn't have the back, you could leave the autumn kind of that wood covered natural. And oh. that would be really cool. Oh, I but guess with so. With the back, it's it just all blends much. together. It's, it's just too much. Yeah. Okay, so we so need something to pop just a little bit. So I have a pokey pole. I actually loaded myself up with three. There it is. Okay. Thanks for doing that for me, hon. Um, I'm going to go back to my other plate because there's room. I'm going to put my glitter paint, glitter glue, whatever we're going to call that, to the side. I'm trying to organize a little bit. Should do it. But it's going to be really pretty. Okay, so this is our project of the week. If you are so good as to sprinkle the love. We do pick somebody from the week set, the weeks set, not a week set. Um, <laughs> we we put the end of the herd. Yeah, to win, <laughs> to win one of these. And we'll just send it to you with no cost. That's way too dark. Oh yeah, it's too dark. Don't think it's too dark? No, I do. You do, okay. <laughs> Well, it depends. Are you going to glitter it too? Probably not. You know what? I almost much. want to. It's not too. It's actually not bad. No, it's a little deep. Mm. Okay. A little brown. I might put a little brown in it. Oh, uh, look at you go, buddy. Look oh. at you go. Just play with your paints, guys, until you're happy. I may pull out some phalo green because it's got that dark blue. That's your marble. Good choice. Just did there rubbing it on there? Is that what you're gonna do? I'm gonna rub it. Oh, look at that! But I'm probably gonna do several coats. Okay. I'm so excited. No, you don't need to do that. It doesn't cover. Oh. You just need the autumn. Well, I'm practicing. <laughs> I'm here for you here. I'm yeah, I'm practicing. It feels good. <laughs> you're gonna, gonna do it on the spike. I'm gonna do now. it all. I'm gonna it's do like, it all. Suck it, Robinson. Give me Take some this. love, ladies, if you know what I mean. <laughs> I'm gonna do it all. <laughs> and if I wouldn't have glittered the leaves, I could glitter this with a nice. That would have been cool too. If yeah, you would have just glittered. If I had the a gold. blackish green, that would be great. But all I have is a Christmas green. And that's that's sending the wrong message. No. It's sending the hey, we're ready for the Grinch, not that we're ready um, for fall. So today's a hot one here. I don't know, how hot is it, Mr. Thermometer Man? It was 99 today. Tomorrow's supposed to be 104. Well, I can't go much hotter. Well, I, I'm <laughs> sorry. I'll, I'll talk to uh, the weather folks and have them change the forecast. So, guys, if you don't hear from me tomorrow, <laughs> it's because I died. <laughs> Heat stroke, y'all. She's laying on the couch with her feet up and a Heat iced stroke. coffee in one hand. And a I've already in the swelled other. like eight pounds because I don't do water retention from the heat. It's like bad. Bad. I might be in my... You're seriously going around the whole outside. I don't want to. It makes me feel good. And it's very tactile. Hey, I'm very fragile. It's hot. Very fragile. Very fragile. Oh, come on. <laughs> you could do that. Let's do the inside with a sponge. You want to be careful. It is a nice font. It's very strong up here. But the bottom doesn't have anything that it's... Um, What's the word? Giving it strength. So you want to be careful. So yeah, I'm going to load my sponge. Just going to mm. get in there. And I know right away I'm going to need to give it a second coat. But it dries super fast. By the time I'm done with the, well, I guess the A, because I'm going backwards, um, I could start at the end again. Are you going to paint the frame again too? Cause... I almost wish I would have stayed with that darker color. So this might be a good base coat for y'all. It's a really quick paint procedure, you know, if you're using a sponge. But what you don't want to use is a sponge that's like gooped up. So yeah, put some on, take huh? some off. Yeah, it'll bleed. Don't want, don't want any drippings. 
And if it's dripping, just grab your paintbrush and clean it up. Who has the brown trick? Colleen's a brown trick. <laughs> that doesn't sell well, does it? <laughs> There's another t-shirt. <laughs> There's another t-shirt. Colleen, we might have to go halfsies on that. <laughs> doing some remodeling of the website a little bit. I was up really late this morning getting in there on our main page, but there was only so much I can do. He was coming up lame. He was like, oh, I'm coughing. I'm sick. Poor fella. You can tell we've been married a long time. <laughs> rub some dirt on it. You'll be fine. Yeah, rub some dirt on it. All right, so I'm going to show you guys what this looks like. It's oh, deep, yeah. but it's not like deep, deep. I don't think it needs a second. You don't think it needs to go? Well, no, because I'm going to cover up the wood grain a little bit on that. If you like it rusty, keep it just I like that. It rusty. Well, good thing it's for me then. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, let me just see. I'm going to go a little deeper. And if you want, I can wipe this off. How about that, babe? I like it deeper, but I, I'll wipe it off for you. You know what? You do you. So it's a win-win. So you don't want me doing well, this eyes. I can take it down and hang my own stuff anyway. I don't care. Oh my gosh, you're so funny. Yeah, this is pretty. I like I would do that. This is pretty. I know my place. Oh my gosh. You used to paint with me every Sunday at the studio. Mm -hmm. Okay, here we go. I really like the deeper one, so... Tuscan Marble, good choice. <gasps> what was he, ladies? He was wrong. But here we go. So yes, this is covered. Now you have that decision to make. Are you going to paint the edging so it's all like one color? And you probably need to. Okay, I'm not. Let's see. Can I put this on here just for a second? Oh yeah. Do you like? I don't know. Unless we cover up that. I think I want to change this to that color. To the green? Yeah. Let's see. Oh, Throw the back on. All right. Ooh. Wait, you need the back. I need the back? It, it does. It, it makes it look Pulls it all together. Okay. I'll have to make that decision. Leave it contrasted. Take, take like the that. top cover off because then you can see it. Oh, okay. So we you... I'm show it again. Okay. I like it better with the wood myself, but I've okay. been wrong before today. All right. So the green, which is very cool, I love it. But I kind of like this too. Kind of hard to decide. What was I gonna do? I like oh, the better. I was gonna do some. You like this better? I do. But okay. So guys. You do you. One, the green, or two, the brown. The brown does make it seem like it's a little bit more put together, huh? Mm -hmm. So two, the brown. G. Okay, so I'm gonna go in and do a little bit of edging, a little shading. Yeah, what do you guys think? Let's see, one or two, one, 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 one. Oh wait, oh, yeah. never mind. Oh, that's you. Oh my gosh. <laughs> we got a few ones, a few twos. We need somebody to make a tiebreaker. Tiebreaker. Okay, let's do some edging. Edging I'm going to do with brown. If it's not dark enough, I'm going to add a drop of black. I'm going to grab my little piece of sponge. I'm going to come in with a little... Uh, okay, we're already... I can tell. We're going to need a little black. Spongebob. So it's dark brown. I'm going to come into my leaves. And if you do it this way, you could break it. So make sure you do it on, on the table. But I'm showing you this way. Don't do it. Don't do okay, it. So I'm all doing. you're gonna do is just kind of. No, Donna up. says she can't decide. I know I can't decide either. Donna, you're not a tiebreaker when you can't decide. That's us ADHD creatives. We just can't figure out crap. <laughs> okay, so I'm just going in. I'm just edging it up a little bit. You know, it'd be really pretty. There's a little gold on it too. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. 
Oops, that's a little, little much. Just a little much. Just go back in with your sponge. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Careful that that piece there. Just a little bit. Okay, I kind of want to paint like 50 of them. And if y'all did that. <laughs> Lisa, that's your first one. Okay, we'll expect your order for five more tomorrow. Okay. Oh my gosh. Okay. So I'm just making a little, a little deeper on the edges. Gonna look, you can. Oh you yeah, can do a little, I see You can do a little more. gold. Does anybody want to see the gold on the red? I would only probably do it on the red. If anybody wants to, give me a little, little heart and I will do it for you. I get disconnected again. I can't see if anybody would be for it. Let me see it. Boom. I'm a waiting. Well, you get a thumbs up too. I did the heart. <laughs> oh, I think I did too. I'm, oh. I'm sending some thumbs ups too. You dork. I know. Okay, where did I put that? But okay, where's my goal? Okay. You get disconnected again. So I'm gonna just show you. Yeah, sometimes <clears throat> for no reason whatsoever our internet blows. Um, for some reason. It was great all day. I didn't have a single problem at work. You used all the good juice. <laughs> okay, so I'm just gonna come in, and just if we don't it. love it, we can soften it with the clean edge. Soften with the clean edge. Another thing you can do with this is go onto YouTube and watch. Oh, nice. Watch me do the other 19 ones I'm gonna paint. Uh, no, yeah, right. <laughs> watch that. These take only a minute or two to make each. Oh, I needed another one. I, oh, perfect. Um, super cool. All right, let's put this puppy together. And I think we are going to keep yeah. keep the brown yeah. from Mr. John. So what that means is I, I'll need to go, after I glue it, I'll paint the edge in a corresponding color. Maybe just black. I don't know. There you go. So here's our sign. I think it's really pretty so but what I know I hope you guys are so talented each and every one of you will make one that's completely different maybe with tail and um, they'll all look amazing so even the white one the white one looked amazing I just wanted to do a little bit different so one of my peers painted the white one all right so let's talk about what time is it uh, you have about 10 minutes yeah 10 minutes let's talk about the tassel so in the photo, you see a string of beads ooh, 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 with a tassel. Oh, I didn't notice that. Yeah. I happen to have some beads, so unless we sell 50 of them, which we did with the Freedom Flag, I could probably make sure you guys all get like eight, nine, ten beads. I have you, get, you get a few bags of that. I have so a few bags. Yeah. Okay, I tend, I tend over folks, me. run her out of beads. Run me out of beads. Run okay. her out of beads. I'm just going to clean up a little bit. That's a t-shirt, too. Run me out of beads, but nobody would know what it means. Just not in pickles. Okay, here you go. You need some tape. And it's not gonna be a very long tassel, so it's, but I'm gonna, I have this little piece of, um, what is this called? A sample, flooring sample, but you could do it with cardboard easily. So you're just gonna take some. Beads. Jute. Jute. Oh. That's what I'm gonna do. Jute to the rescue, and I'm gonna tape it like on the back. So it's pretty simple. People, some people just use like clipboards. Um, I say look around if you got something around the house you're not using that looks like a piece of cardboard, you're good to go. So I'm just gonna tape it down. It's probably overkill. You just wanna tape it so it doesn't move. <laughs> okay. okay. That was pretty typical. And then all we're gonna do is just gonna, whoop, whoop, we're just gonna, what are we calling this? Wrap, we're just wrapping. Wrapping, 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 wrapping. It's kind of like making those pom-pom animals. So you could go 80 million times, but I'm not gonna. You're bored already. Bored <laughs> already. All right, so I'm gonna cut it off. 
Yeah. I'm making the tassel. Uh, this hairy uh, thing at the end. The, hairy, the thing that looks like Cousin It. The hairy tassel. Okay. Yep. So I'm going to just cut it off. I'm not going to worry about it too much. Um, and then I'm going to take a piece. Am I doing it right? I'm trying to remember. Um, it's been a while. Okay, so I like to cut the bottom. Just hold it in the center so you don't lose it. Just gonna run the scissors through there and cut on the bottom. It's gonna be just a terrible haircut, like a bowl cut, and it's okay because we can go back through and we can fix it later. You're making me nervous. Okay. Boom. There's my piece. There's my piece. So it's kind of like a little hairdo. Okay. That is. So I want to, I'm gonna just keep my finger in there. I want a piece, or put a piece here on the end to go into my beads. So I'm gonna cut a little piece. Some people just keep it on the clipboard the whole time. You can rub it from my phone. Clipboard guys. Okay, so I'm just gonna tie this on the end, do a little loop or what have you. So you have something, it's probably too tight. Um, something to tie on to. I'm going to keep it loose. If I don't need it, I'll take it off. It just depends. All right, now, how long? Everybody's got that one piece of hair, right? Now you want to go around to create that, that little tassel -y look. You can use thread. Okay, so here we go. This was not at all what I was expecting. You weren't expecting this at all, so I'm going to tie it off. No, but I see it. You see it? It took me a minute. It's really an old-fashioned craft. And you can get your butt down to Hobby Lobby and you can buy yourself a teal one. But <laughs> if you can't and you have a few minutes on your hands, you can just tie that off. And I'm just going to go around. Do, 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 make it nice and neat. You can decide how high, how low you go. Um, you go. And then we're gonna tie it off. So I buried my piece, so I'm just, of course I did. Um, so I'm just gonna take another piece. He's sacrificing himself. Just tying it off. So jute comes in different shapes and sizes. Dollar Tree jute and Hobby Lobby jute are a little bit different, but honestly, Sometimes you're just happy to have it. So this one's a little shaggy. Shaggy. It may not go into my beads very well. Okay. So this is pretty um, disheveled, frizzy, bad haircut. So I'm just gonna come in here. And take a little off at a time. That's beautiful. Do, 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 do. So I made this one here. This one's actually a little bit better because it's skinnier jute. Has a little thing at the top. It's got a little, you want this little, um, almost like a needle eye. This one I kind of went crazy. It's like humongous. So I'm gonna toss that one and we're gonna use the one I had <laughs> from last week. It's prettier. So less is more. So I believe I'm gonna use this other string. I'm hoping it will go into my beads. So I'm gonna start with a pretty, pretty bead. Oh, this one is really pretty. Does it have a hole in it? It just, oh, that is the world's tiniest hole. And that's And we're rounding the corner on our okay, two. Okay, and you lost <laughs> me while I sort through these beads because they're gorgeous. Okay, look at this one. It tries to thread the bead. Yeah, and you can paint the wood ones like I did. Um, don't think you're going to get both, like you're not going to double down on, on the jute and get it through any of these beads. It's just not going to happen. In fact, singularly might not happen either. Where's Isn't that pokey? a pokey tool? Oh. Pokey. So I do a lot of trimming. So cord would be a lot better. Oh, and I do have cord. I do. Oh, that worked. It went right through. Okay. And so what I like to do is just tie off a section so it's a loop at the end so we can tie except I cut it off so we can tie the um, tassel to it doesn't have to be that big come on guys get it together get it 
together. That's what I say to my basset all the time. Lou, be cool. It has a little loop. It has a little loop. It's, it's pretty big, but it's for demonstrative purposes. Okay. And Great then you could paint your beads. They're black, white, brown like the photo. Super. And you're just going to go ahead and string them through. Good Lord. Chubby jute. That's a t-shirt. Chubby <laughs> Jude. Edward, that Chubby one Chubby Jude. Where'd that pokey toe go? Oh, there it is. Keep something handy that you can just shove that through. Keep your scissors handy. Oh, and so there, you're going to get that all the time. Maybe I should use the cord. You get this. I'm already you got six minutes. Start with a longer piece of jute than what you want. <laughs> Good Lord. The tape trick doesn't work so good either. I hate the tape trick. All right, go ahead and find yourself another ball. Boom. One. Pretend like, <laughs> pretend like I stained them. A pretty, pretty color. Why do you hate me so One and a half. Got it. Oh, wait, it's going to do that razzle-dazzle. Two. You're going to keep going. Make your husband do it because you're already bored. <laughs> Keep going. Make yourself happy. Tie it off. You can stain them at that point or what have you. And then you can tie it into your tassel. Keep going or be done now. Yes, exactly. <laughs> I'm going to tie it off really quick. And I definitely need to stain them. So what I'll do is just water down some brown. Oh, that's pretty. Do, 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 do. So we got a little tassel-y tassel and some balls. You got some gorgeous balls. You know, while I have the pretty balls, I can I can hand you one, but you might end up with the pig one. There's one that looks just like a pig. But you guys probably have your own pretty balls at home. Anyway, if you're interested, call the old joke corner. If you're interested, it's on our website already. It's $24. You get the paint and uh, the glitter, whatever I use tonight. I'll just box it up, including the glue. So if Can you're gonna, we please outsell the scarecrow? <laughs> um, some glue. So I did try the Tight Bond original wood glue with the red, not the blue. The blue does not work. So the teal works great, the red is cheaper and works better, and I like the nozzle. The nozzle. dollar store, or dollar tree, I got a new one right here. A dollar tree, um, if you just don't wanna put a lot of expense in, it's really good, but it does set pretty fast. So it still gives you a little time to play. This gives you a little more time to play, and this gives you a little bit more time to play. So if I were to put them in order, of um, setting uh, sets first, second, and third. So it's this whatever you have at home. Don't over, <laughs> don't over glue, please, because it will ooze out. This is the project we did tonight. Mm -hmm. It works out to be over an inch thick, so it will set pretty good. Great, you or, or Hungry! Least, I know, I think I'm hungry. You never feeds me. So I think it came out great. Let me know what you think. They're on our website, or if you just want us to invoice you, we can do that too. And typically we take orders this week. They go out next Monday. Um, and then we're looking to give gift one away. So yeah, make sure oh, that you- Oh, you got hurts coming out your ears. Whoop. That one looked good. It did. It did that came good. out good. It came out good. That's um, no, as- Don't forget this uh, one. <laughs> don't forget your fishing lure. <laughs> I, I don't do the real tiny crafts very well. Okay. Thanks, Gail. Thanks for all the good uh, luck. And happy Monday to you all. Thanks for watching. I'm Kelly Sue with Cleopatra. And okay, bye. <laughs> oh, my gosh. It's such a big.